Recent reports have significantly heightened speculation within NBA circles that the Washington Wizards are considering trading veteran center Jonas Valanciunas as early as December. This potential move is generating considerable interest across the league, particularly because Valanciunas, who signed a lucrative three-year $30 million contract, will become eligible for trade after a specific period. This eligibility has led to a flurry of rumors and strategic assessments from various teams. According to Sean Devaney of Heavy.com, the Los Angeles Lakers, Golden State Warriors, and New York Knicks are the primary teams showing interest in acquiring Valanciunas. The Knicks' interest will depend largely on how their center position evolves over the first part of the season, an NBA executive shared with Devaney in July. The same executive also mentioned the Lakers as a potential destination. The Warriors could also become involved if their pursuit of Laurie Markkanen does not work out. Each of these teams presents a unique context where Valanciunas could make a substantial impact, given their current roster needs and strategic objectives for the season. For the Los Angeles Lakers, the addition of Valanciunas could provide a significant boost. The Lakers have historically performed well when Anthony Davis plays as the center, but the grueling 82-game NBA season presents challenges that require a reliable backup. Davis has struggled with injuries in the past, making it crucial for the Lakers to have a dependable center who can share the load and potentially start alongside him when necessary. Currently, the Lakers' center options include Jackson Hayes and Christian Wood. While both players are capable, Valanciunas would offer a considerable upgrade in terms of both experience and overall skill. His ability to contribute effectively on both ends of the court would help in managing the wear and tear on Davis throughout the season and provide stability for the team's front court. In the case of the New York Knicks, Valanciunas could address a pressing need on their roster. Following the departure of Isaiah Hartenstein in free agency, the Knicks have a limited number of true centers available behind Mitchell Robinson. Although the Knicks might opt for a smaller lineup with their second unit, Hartenstein's impact during the playoffs last season underscored the importance of having depth at the center position. Valanciunas could fill this void by offering both stability and experience. His presence would help in maintaining a strong defensive front, and providing a reliable scoring option in the paint, which the Knicks have been missing since Hartenstein's exit. The Golden State Warriors, while also interested, face a more complex situation. The team's current center options are limited to Trace Jackson Davis and veteran Kevon Looney, while the Warriors are actively pursuing Laurie Markkinen, who could offer a more significant impact if acquired Valanciunas represents a valuable alternative should that deal not materialize. The Warriors' championship aspirations make it essential for them to explore every possible option to bolster their roster. Valanciunas could provide the necessary support in the center position, contributing to both their offensive and defensive schemes. His experience and capability to perform in high-pressure situations would be an asset as the Warriors strive for another title run. Devaney's report also notes that the Lakers have been most frequently associated with Valanciunas, but have exhibited hesitation to part with their tradable draft picks. This reluctance could influence the dynamics of any potential trade involving the veteran center. For the rebuilding Wizards, strategically utilizing their current cap space to acquire future assets and young talent is a prudent approach. By leveraging Valanciunas as a trade asset, the Wizards can align their current strategy with their long-term goal of building a competitive team for the future. This is a really smart signing because it secured a good deal at a time when there weren't many spots available. It's a game of musical chairs, and if you don't get one of the top slots now with the new rules, you're in trouble, the executive elaborated to Devaney. There's less flexibility now, but this deal gets you paid, and the team that pays you can say, hey, will get you to a contender when the time comes. The exact destination for Valanciunas remains uncertain as various factors will influence the trade market as the season progresses. Each interested team has its own set of needs and strategic considerations that could ultimately determine the outcome of any trade. As the trade deadline approaches, the focus will intensify on the Wizards and their decision regarding this key player. The outcome of this potential trade could have significant implications for the teams involved and shape their paths for the remainder of the season.